Okay, I told you it would be Civ 4. And it is. And I'm going to play... I'm going to play Nobles Club 188, Genghis Khan on DD. Now, I actually played an hour through this, and I was trying so hard to do a horse archer rush, and I failed, and I realized just how out of shape I am, so I decided to just go ahead and uh, do this again. Still trying to do a horse archer rush. I... Um, I don't know, I just, the, the low commerce start is kind of tricky for this leader, so I'm, this is actually, just be aware, this is kind of my, my sem second attempt here. Uh, deity, normal speed, like I said, the, the horse archer rush, um, with a low commerce start with this leader is not easy. Uh, anyway, um, Genghis Khan is aggressive and imperialistic. He's not the better Khan. The better Khan is um, actually Kublai Khan because he has creative instead of aggressive. Aggressive doesn't really do us any good when we're using Keshix, which you don't... Okay, you don't have to use Keshix, but they're fun, and you probably should. So the starting technology is the wheel and hunting... And it's not the greatest starting tech combo, but it's not too bad considering what we're going to do. I uh, definitely love the wheel. The gear is a stable with plus four experience points instead of plus two, and that's pretty much the only difference. A little extra experience, kind of nice. Um, not really game-breaking. The Keshik is a mounted unit. It does not, It is not immune to first strikes. This is something to keep in mind, but it does have one first strike, and that makes it better versus some... Um, like melee units and uh, anything that doesn't ignore first strikes um, but a little bit weaker on archers which have a lot of first strikes right um, it also ignores train movement costs which is kind of cool um, it's a cool it's 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 a fun you know little um, unique unit to use not uh, not as overwhelmingly powerful as some people might think I actually like the um, uh, I like the Numidian Cavalry better, but they're still fun to use. These these guys are fun to use, and Mongolia is fun to do horse archer wretches with, which is what I'm going to try to do here. Um, the last time, I just, I, oof, I'm out of shape. What can I say? Um, I wasn't quite prepared to deal with a low commerce start here. The trouble is uh, you've got to tack to get to horse archery, and you've got to get really early libraries. Kublai Khan makes this easy because he gets half, um, he gets libraries at half cost. Really easy to get there with Kublai Khan or any creative leader. In fact, creative leaders are great for horse archer rushes, I find. But Genghis um, is just doesn't, his, his traits are crap. Just uh, imperialistic and, uh, and, um, Aggressive. Those are both kind of crap traits. Um, so he's he's actually tough to pull off. The computer does it well because the computer starts with a bunch of extra tech, and if, you know that uh, can expand like crazy. Um, but you, on the other hand, it's not so easy for you. So um, I don't think moving will help us. So we're just going to stay in place. Now, you might think, well, commerce, you can get the fish, right? And that'll help, but uh, it's not quite so simple because this fish, turns out you can't actually get over there so easy. You have to settle another city over here first. So here's what I'm going to do. Um, the fastest way to get a writing is just go animal husbandry writing. Uh, that's what we're going to do. We're going to try that. <laughs> Just animal husbandry writing. We're going to skip. Um, and this is the thing that's tricky with, with these kind of starts and this game is you, you sometimes have to stick uh, skip text that you otherwise might think it would be beneficial to research just because you just don't have the commerce in that particular situation to actually get the tech in time to make it useful. And there's Arabia. And that's what hung me up there. Like I said, haven't actually done a pure horse archer rush in a long time. Uh, not on deity anyway. And it's tricky to pull off sometimes, especially in this case. 
What in the hell was that? Oh, I do believe I actually have to give the barbs their starting text, don't we? Otherwise, who knows what's going to happen. Totally forgot about that. If you don't, if you don't give them archery, then the barb cities will spawn with a bunch of warriors, and the AI will just uh, gobble them up like nobody's business. And you'll end up with some AIs having way too much land. Speaking of way too much land, looks like somebody right here has got way too much land. And, of course, he gets what? Nope, he didn't get that religion. He's going for the next one, I guarantee you. Saladin's crazy religious fanatic. Okay. Hope. Holy crap! My computer night might need a reset. So we're just going writing, just right from here. That's what we're gonna do. Sixteen turns. And like I said, this would be so much easier with Kublacan, but jeez. Hello, Peter. Petey boy. Yep, Arabia got Hinduism. Yep, he got one of them. Didn't take him too long. Okay. I don't need a lot of cities. I just need early horse archers, basically. And right now I don't have anything to do, so we rode. Okay, there's our horses. So we rode and we rode to where we would probably put the next city. Ugh. I think the computer needs a reset. I was just running Unity and all that kind of crap. I think it really needs a reset. I might have to reset halfway through this video here because it's just, whoa, it's bad. So I guess we, yeah, we don't have, we don't have anything to do. This is the tricky part, you know, I don't have anything for this worker to do. Okay, so I could grow to another size in four. Is that a wise idea? I could get another settler in, I could get a settler in nine. Maybe it'd be better to get that settler out first. That way we definitely grab that, uh, that pasture those horses right there and it might be okay thinking about like where to put that city rather than up here it might be okay to put it down there that way we grab <coughs> sorry about that that way we can work that and that oof Here's Sitting Bull. Whew, man. Will sign up with Borders. Really? Already? I think he's up there. That was a really early writing for Ragnar. Actually, because of the, there's another thing with the early writing for me. Because of early writing... I can open borders and get commerce with these guys really early. So, and I can even get the religion off Arabia because, um, well, I don't know if he's in monotheism yet. Or you don't have to, you don't have to be in monotheism to make it, no. No, he's, he's gonna build, yeah. He, he builds, he likes to spam, uh, religious guys. So, we're almost there. And there's nowhere else I think I need to actually put anything. So that's another... Uh, early, early writing has a lot of advantage. Is crap. I wasn't paying attention there. What else? We probably want to go mining, bronze working. Okay, but we want to open borders with Arabia. He's got the religion. That'll maybe mean that I don't have to... Um, maybe. 
it will mean that I don't have to build a monument. I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't count on it necessarily, but it's possible. Okay, so now we need to build a library. This is going to be a pain in the ass, don't you know? 14 turns, okay, not too bad, not too bad. Okay, and I think we want to go right here, right? We, I think we'll, yeah, right there. Because that lets us kind of share food. Um, another library, no, but we do need to get, we want to grow a little bit. We, we're going to need another warrior. So I would actually say, you don't have to, well, Let's let that grow a little bit. There we go. It's okay. We're, we're actually... Aha! There he is. There's that stupid barb. Okay, hopefully he doesn't get lucky and win. No, he says... Uh, no. Okay, I, I don't need to open borders with any of these guys right now, so I'm not going to. Okay... He's, he's not taking the bait. Okay, we're going roading into Arabia here. Hopefully Arabia sends me a missionary or two. There we go. Got rid of the barb. Okay, cool. Okay, we didn't want that guy hanging around there. That's all. We're going to send them, send my guy back. Arabia, yes. Okay, two mining... This is turning out much better than the other game, let me tell you. Uh, it was key getting getting very early writing, and you, you, look at this prick, he stole this so early. The man who moves a mountain begins by carrying away small stones. Okay, yeah, and we immediately want to go for bronze working, I would say yes. Nothing else matters, we'll get that eventually, don't worry. There's actually, there's copper up here. Um, we just need to be able to get, need to be able to get a settler. And we're probably going to have to get it out of Kokorum. And like I said, bronze working, we're going there immediately. Actually, I might put my slider down and wait for that library. There we go. Okay, we should be getting a little bit more right, yeah. And we can see Arabia, what Arabia's doing. Bronze working in 10. Wait a little bit longer here. Uh, I don't need to open borders with anybody else right now the situation here yeah everybody nobody hates Saladin so he's safe to have open borders with we're gonna get a warrior I'm probably going to try and build a settler out of here I want to settle got another spot over here I could settle I want to settle that spot kind of I might even build a farm here because we can get oh wait I can't do that because I don't have the ability to build farms yet okay that's right. Forgot about that. Okay, so we got another another thing there. Can I get that library any quicker? Get it in four turns. I guess that means, uh, yeah. All right, fine. The sooner the better, I say, so... Stonehenge. Go ahead and put roads here. Let's go for Settler. I'm gonna need one. And this prick, this prick Arabia, he is not going to give me his religion for some weird reason. So I can't get out any border props here for right now. I'm sure he'll give me I'm sure he'll give it to me eventually. He's the only one with a religion though. So opening borders with anybody else isn't gonna help me. He 
You see how faster, how much faster this would have been with Kubla? Oh my god, dude. Victoria will trade corn. Um, oh, I, we have corn. We have corn. We don't need that. Um, what else can I do? What else? Let's see. Bronze working in six. Let's put roads down here because we're going to chop these forests probably. Let's set this guy up here to kind of look out there. Keep any barbs away. There we go with the library. Yes. Finally. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. And let's see here. We could grow one, one size. But I think what I'd want probably is a worker more than anything. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Let's make sure that isn't what I think it is. Um, let me let me actually open borders with the Vikings. Maybe. Oh my God, he's already got alpha. Holy crap, dude! That was an early, early alpha. Okay, so maybe the Vikings might help me with that guy if he can go in my territory. Maybe. Hopefully, he's not coming in. Oh, he's coming in. Oh, wonderful. That's exactly what I was hoping that didn't happen, and it happened. And hopefully, hopefully, he doesn't take the city. Oh my god. Oh. Whew. Okay. <laughs> Alright, well that's my fault for not having a guy in there. Oh, I just got um, Hinduism. Awesome. Alright. Alright, no more goofing off then. <laughs> anyway. Well, it was, you know. It almost happened. Uh, Hinduism, no, not yet, but, um, I do appreciate the, uh, the border pop I'm going to get for that now. Okay, bronze working. Yes. It is entirely seemly for a young man killed in battle to lie mangled by the bronze... And we're, we want the settler. First, we want the settler. That's the first thing we want. Uh... Did I get bronze working before anybody? No. Man, that Ragnar, how's he how's he teching like that? That's what I want to know. Um, okay, I'm going to put my slider down. Um, I guess in this case, archery or just uh, just go horseback riding. Let's just start going horseback riding. There's no reason not to. We can get archery from somebody else. Nope, not going to not gonna do any whipping yet. Not yet. I might I don't know, I might might consider doing the whipping the settler or something. Silly Ragnar's not gonna give me his uh, thing. Yeah, Ragnar is the wrong guy to get that, but if somebody else gets uh gets alpha, then I can trade with them. Ragnar, you have to be pleased for him to give you something like that. I kind of do want to swip, switch into slavery. Maybe to whip something in Gikorum. Oh, God! Really? Holy crap, Saladin! Holy effing crap! He did not expand this fast in the, in the last game. That is quick, man. Holy crap, 1920 BC. I can't beat him. He's just too freaking quick off the draw there. Well, I'm going to have to go right there. And that'll get me that'll get me access to these tiles. This this guy can work this tile. This this capital can work these. So, it's not a big deal. We have plenty of food, but we're going to need at least 3 cities. Um we could do with less, but well, actually no. I think 3 cities is probably as 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 low as you want to go. I could put another one right here if I really wanted to question is do I really want to probably not I would say I'm probably just gonna stick with these three cities here we're probably gonna whip that settler pyramids who built those France France is building the mids I'm going to chop that worker if I can. 
I think we're going to whip that guy and then probably whip him into a worker. Or... Hmm. <laughs> Here comes that barb. Or we might need a... We might need a warrior, I think, because of the stupid barb. You coming in? You're coming in, aren't you? I knew you were coming in. I knew it. Okay, well, I can't move because of the stupid barb. Okay, horseback riding. We're getting a great scientist in a bit. Uh, I think, um, yeah, I think we'll want horseback riding, or we'll want we'll want a great scientist. We'll want an academy before we start spending our money, teching. Okay, well, okay, so he's probably not going to get us. He's he's an underdog to uh, to actually succeed here, so we should be okay. We get another warrior or what? Library? No. Library? No. Um, warrior? Maybe. Let's let's think about getting a warrior here. Okay, good. He failed. And we're going to put this city right here. Okay. All right. Um, probably need a worker. And, yeah, we need to, uh, let's see, we need to get that online. Hmm, <sighs> should I go for, really quickly, should I go for, like, agriculture or something? Agriculture in four? Or fishing. Fishing might be nice, too. Fishing in three... Fishing something I could use to, because we get, we get a little bit more commerce out of that. Fishing sounds nice to me. But I'd really, I don't know if I'm going to get to trade, like, horseback riding for, for alpha or anything like that. So let's just go for fishing right now. Let's just go for stuff that we know we can use, right? Be nice if he gave me uh, some more of his religion over here. That would be really great. What the hell did I just do? I didn't don't, don't even remember doing that. Somehow I did it. Okay, fishing in one. Yeah. Okay, that's better. Probably need agriculture at some point. Right over here, I think I'm going to whip that work boat. It's too bad that uh, I can't share any, any of this food with anybody else over here. I think we'll, uh, let's see, we need to go for... Well, if I do this, I'm going to have to... No, let's go over here and fix that. Four turns, all right. I'm gonna go ahead and just whip this really quickly. Agriculture in two. Uh, don't need to do that. And why does no one else have any religions? Did uh, did Saladin hog them all or what? That's awful suspicious. Saladin, what the heck, bro? trying to figure out where to go here. I do want to get these mines up at some point. Let's go just go down here. Here comes the leg. The borders I guess. Now I, I kinda wanna attack him. He's the one building all the wonders, so I don't really want to open borders with him yet. Farmers, pray that your summers be wet. Holy crap. Yeah, I think the computer needs a reset. I think we're going to go ahead and reset the computer here.
So I'll be right back. Okay, that's a little bit better. All right, we were going, I guess, no, we're just slowly moving over there, I guess. Okay, there we go. That'll help a little bit. Uh, could get things like pottery. I think I'm going to go, we're not going to be whipping too much anymore. Or for a little while. So, um, I'm going to skip pottery until I can get horseback riding. I might be able to get, like, uh, horseback riding for alpha. And then, of course, catch up and everything else, right? Yeah, I think we're gonna. I think we're gonna wait. We're also gonna put our slider down to save a little money for when we get an academy. Did did my what the ah? Oh, what the heck happened there? Who destroyed my thing? I'm not getting any trade routes because somebody destroyed my road. Must have been a barb or something. Um, okay, well we'll have to wait until we're done on that pasture there. That was, uh, that was nice. Okay. So, let me see if I can trade some resources, maybe, for some nice stuff. Um, I could start trading with Regnar. I don't think, I think that's fine, even though we, uh, we have Clam. That's okay. That's okay. We can break that deal later. But the, the idea is we, we start trading with Regnar. And I gotta fix my freaking, uh, roads over here, man. Apparently, someone isn't competent enough to keep the barbs from smashing them. I'm probably going to switch. There we go. There we go. Cocorn's a little bit better now. And I guess we'll make... Uh, we don't need a library, but we will make a barracks. Or start making a barracks here. And we got one turn, turn till a great... Uh, one turn till a great scientist. There he is. Settle him. Okay, now we go for horseback riding. Pedal, pedal of the metal over there. There you go. And then we fix that road. And then we've got another guy there just in case somebody shows up. Um, another worker there in two. Building what a barracks. That's fine. Horseback riding in seven. I find it doesn't help to uh, have any more than one library if you're doing a horse archer rush because the other places would have to really slow down what they're doing to um, uh, to get another library and actually run a couple of scientists usually. So I find it just not beneficial. Okay, so we should be getting an increase to our... Yeah, there it is. I'm going to go ahead and get that online, and then, uh, yep, do that. I'm thinking, really thinking about the French here. They're building wonders. Yeah, pyramids and the Great Wall, both things that I, I wouldn't mind having. Pyramids especially. Um, we're probably going to want to whip something. What can we whip here? Could we squeeze out another settler right there? I guess we could. I can't believe how early I got boxed in here. This is insane. We could definitely... No, we can't put one right there. We could put one right there, but he wouldn't necessarily have anything to work. This is looks like the only spot I actually have. And it's not a bad, not a bad idea. I'm going to wait until I get to size 6 to start, though. Because if I whip now... If I whip now, I'll be at size 3, and then it'll take too long. So, let's go, go in horseback riding. Arabia's going... Aha! Somebody else... Okay, good. Somebody else got alpha, which means we can do alpha for horseback riding. Yeah. Barracks, Barracks, who built the Oracle? Unknown. Somebody we haven't even met. There's six guys, so there's, yeah. There seems to be a, at least an extra person on this map. I would kind of rather you be working like that. I 
think I'm going to settle this one more city up here because... Or actually, wait a minute. I don't have to do that. I don't know. It'd be an extra city. It wouldn't be a great city, but it'd be an extra city. I guess because I don't really have too much to do other than maybe whip a few cities. But that might not be the best thing to do with our time, though. We might want to whip workers instead. I, it looks tempting to put another city down. Shut up. Demand all you want, dude. I don't care. Mm, I think we might want to just, what, do that, that. Nobody's plotting yet. Okay, horseback riding. If you speak the truth, nice. Now we go for Alpha. We're going to probably whip that Jir for a three-pop whip right there. And I'm going to try to get a little play out of Alpha for horseback riding. Try to do something like that. And again, we're, we're pumping up our, our uh, tech rate as much as we can here. Artificially, for now. Let's see here. Alpha, not yet. Hopefully we'll get it. Ragnar is coming in with, a, with another settler. I'm not sure why. Ah, Hyanna Kapak. And Hyanna Kapak actually has... Uh, also has Alpha. Ho, ho, ho yourself, Santa Claus. Let's see if it's maybe just an issue of... Yeah, okay, it's... it's the tech's good. The tech's good still. All right, next... Ah, Arabia's are searching Alpha. Okay. Probably this turn we can do it. There we go. Got it. Words have the power to both oh yeah, baby. When words are both true and kind, they can change our world. Um, let's see here. We probably want things like iron working. Yeah. Let's go ahead and whip that finally. I think we're kind of done. We're going to be needing some more some more workers, too. It would be great if I could get math, but the one guy who has math is probably not going to trade it to me. All right, so Ragnar plops down yet another city. Okay, I'm going to try and trade... Let's see... Try and grab myself iron working from somebody. Really? Well, so you so you give me what? Pottery? I'll take it. He's just about got it. She there we go. You should hammer your iron. Sure iron don't have any. Um Saladin is teching it, but that doesn't mean I can't get something off him for it. Which is the idea there. Okay, so I got all I need to bust out with some horse archers. I might even do masonry for Polly. Um, Ragnar, are you bribable right now? Not on anybody I want. Who else is bribable in this pack? Saladin, maybe. Who would he maybe attack? Would he attack De Gaulle? Nothing to gain, he says. No. De Gaulle's kind of the one I want to target here. I wonder if anybody was going to get math pretty soon. It's possible. It's about the time for them to get math, is the thing. Uh, anyway, so before I start chopping, I kind of want to get math, but 
if I don't, if it doesn't happen, it doesn't happen. And it's not a, it's not a big deal if it doesn't happen. Oh yeah, we want granaries, that's what we were missing. Yeah, greenery, definitely. I'm going to do roads. No, we don't want to switch into that yet. We want greeneries. Yeah, we want greeneries there big time. So let's see if anybody gets math, huh? We could also do this, and maybe this wouldn't be such a bad idea since he's going to get alpha anyway. You know what? Why not Victoria? No, not no. Okay, I'll get Polly. Not at all similar of the race. Of Couple the people still don't have Polly, but I can't get masonry Walker. off them. Unfortunately, those people don't have priesthood either. All right, but we'll see. We'll we'll hold on to our our horse, um, our advantage there with horse archer tech, and we'll see what happens. I'm gonna whip that greenery into. I guess into a barracks, and then we'll whip the, the uh, lighthouse. So we're getting ready. We're not quite re ready to bust out just yet. Ah, look who's going for currency. Dude, seriously. I'm going to say no. He, he makes a lot of demands, but he never really, he doesn't really attack that I remember. Okay, two turns. I think two turns and we'll whip a lighthouse into the greenery. What else do we got? Yeah. Nobody's got any happy stuff. Okay. Oh, look who's plotting. wonder who he's plotting on. Gonna be something to find out, by the way. Yeah, we want to know who he's plotting on. Lighthouse, then barracks. I really wish I had some some happiness resources here, but we don't. Really, kind of, kind of tough this situation. This is actually not an easy map with this leader. This leader is not a great leader. Um, he's definitely one of the lower end. He looks he looks amazing when the AI plays him, but that's just because of all the AI stupid bonuses. But uh, you play him, it's not going to be quite so good. Uh, he's really kind of tough to play. And I can't believe nobody has any happiness resources for trail. Oh, wait, maybe... Oh, there we go. De Gaulle does. De Gaulle... Trade everything I got for your freaking. You got it? Nothing to gain. Nothing to gain. Nothing to gain. Dang it, man. Why well, I can't give away the horses? Because that's kind of like my, my thing. <laughs> Without the horses, I don't have anything. Without horses, I have basically nothing. Okay, so we got the uh, we got everything here we need in the capital. Problem is we've got uh, oh my god plus three unhappiness that's not going to go away anytime soon. I guess I'll go ahead and grab that uh, grab that right there. So we're gonna have to have a little help I think. We might Vikings don't like Sydney Bull. Oh. Declare war on Hyanna Kapak. No. What is it? Oh. We could ask him to liberate that, but I don't think he'd do it. Somebody tells me he's not going to do that. Okay, well, we're going to get to... We're going to get to Keshik's here with this guy. 
and whip into a gear, I think. Uh, I can't, I can't just, I don't have any reason to do that. I'm not even sure why I'm still open borders with uh, the Vikings. They're not really doing anything for me either. The Gald Zops universal suffrage because he's, he's a prick and he's got that, uh, that one thing. I need I need another all I got is horses it's, it's really tough uh, I can't use those because then I can't build horses but I really need happiness now shut up um, it would be nice if I could switch into Hinduism but the darn fool won't won't spread it to my cities for some reason Okay, well, we're 800 BC, and we're going to start with the Keshiks. Ah, somebody else has elephants. It's too bad. I ran into this problem once before with Gaul, and that's... Uh, he's got a lot of elephants. <laughs> now... Hmm. I could get those elephants from him and do an elephant rush on somebody. Get math go to construction really quick, but I don't think no, I don't think so. I don't think I want to do that though. I think we want to do the Keshiks. Keshiks are nothing. I'm gonna to have to pick somebody who doesn't have elephants. Unfortunately, that means that Degal is out unless he gets, unless he stays away from construction for a while. What am I doing with math? Holy crap! I shouldn't be doing that. I was getting carried away there. Okay, here we come with the Keshiks, hard and fast. Just need some happiness resources, that's all. Whip that into a gear, into a Keshik. All right, um, let's see, let's see here. Who do we got? We got Arabia with frickin' 10 cities. What has he got? He's got two things that I want. Um, the Inca are... Where are the Inca? Four cities, really. Inca are building a couple of wonders that are decent, too. If only I could find them. Where are the Inca? Where are the Inca? The Inca are down there isolated. They would be a really prime target if I could only find out where the hell they are. Um, hold on. This might give me a clue here. Uh, let's see. Inca, 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 Inca. There you are. Okay. 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 Any border, border stuff. Border stuff. Nope, no border stuff, so I can't get, like, a clue as to where they are. Hmm. Just have to look for them, I guess. They've got four cities. All right, well, we'll send a guy out to just look, see if I can find him. Or maybe two guys. I would think they're probably not up here, but I don't know. Great thing about Keshiks is they make pretty good scouts. Because they can move through anything. Okay, so we're 700 BC. Our target is maybe 500 BC. 
to attack, although I don't know if I'm going to do that because I, it's a little late. This, this start is not easy. Hmm. Okay, that's illuminating. Come on, guys. Tell me there's some happiness resources available that I can get. Nope. De Gaulle's gold is no longer available. I might be able to buy those elephants for a hefty price. What do you what do you want for those elephants, dude? Okay. I can I can dig. I could do that. That helps. That helps. <laughs> Leave me that helps. Um, I'm kind of... I may have to wait for somebody else to... To do a war here. I don't have open words with the French. Well, let's fix that. Yeah... could I possibly take out? I might have to go for like Saladin, even though he's got ten freaking cities, but he might he might avoid some of the the techs that are dangerous to me. Ooh, currency, I may be able to do it. May be able to do currency with horseback riding or monarchy and then switch for Monarchy would be easier, and then I could switch to currency. If I had both horseback riding and monarchy, maybe, if I was lucky. Um, yeah, well, I don't know where to go yet, so. Uh-huh. Oh, won't trademark. You prick. Well, maybe I can just hard hard build it for currency. Hard, hard get currency there. Maybe. Maybe. Probably not, but there's a chance. Well, Ragnar for miles, De Gaulle for miles, holy boy, holy moly. Uh, yeah, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? I'm going to attack somebody, but I don't know who, and I don't want to run into elephants, that's for damn sure. It's the big fear is running into the elephants here. Shut up. You are... Ah, good. So, Ragnar's at war with somebody. What does Ragnar have as far as tech? Or what does Ragnar have, period? Um, he has no wonders. He has probably construction by now. Does he have elephants is my big question. He has construction. Does he have elephants? What am I looking at here? Does, oh, he does. Oh, shoot. But he doesn't have horseback riding. Does he have anything worth taking? I could take it. I could take like these two cities easy. This this city over here would be a, sh a cinch. He has a great capital. I could get his elephants before he gets horseback riding. Sitting bull, bro. 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 It's just, it's one of those things that it's like, seat of my pants kind of a decision. I don't, I, I want to take out like the Inca instead, but this is, this is what a good opportunist does. And to win at Civ 4 Deity, you have to be a good opportunist. Yeah, I'm thinking Ragnar, bro. 
<laughs> me three cities, Regnar has eight cities. Eight cities isn't out of the, you know, this isn't out of my league. It's, you know, not what I'd like to fight. But it isn't out of my league. Okay, so I've got... I've got a few. What are we doing here? We got 20-something. We probably want to get out at least one archer. So we'll grow it a couple of turns. What about Keshik in five? Keshik in five. What about taking that? That would be good. So this base production is eight. So three turns, that'll be 24, which would be a little bit more than I want. Oh, we finally got a religion here. Oh, my God. Yeah, okay. So just give Ragnar a few turns to go up there. He does... He does have um, elephants, but he does not have the tech to use them yet. I might be able to get in there and wipe him out or get to his elephants before he has that chance because, remember, he, he just attacked somebody. and He attacked City Bull. City Bull is no wimp. Uh, City Bull is going to be sitting there uh, defending for a little while, and, and he's pretty he's pretty strong. Can I do this? Can we do this? Come on, baby. Monarchy, come on. Why not? Why can't we do that? Don't know. But we'll just give that to him. We might be able to pull this off. Hopefully we can. Okay. You guys are going to stay here for now. I'm just watching to make sure he doesn't get horseback riding. It's it's really risky, but I think I can take a couple of his cities before he gets it. If he does get it, then I'm going to have to stop for sure. It's just not something I can handle there. Oh, look who's going for feudalism. E. So this is we're we're right at the cusp of where you wanna where you wanna stop thinking about a horse archer rush. Five hundred and fifty. If it hits about five hundred, then you know I've got to be kind of careful because that's feudalism time. Let's see here, what do we got? We got a Keshik almost. I'll go ahead and chop that into that. There we go. But Regnar's he he's got his he's got his guys going in the other direction. So. I think. I, I'm not sure exactly where Sitting Bull is. I assume he's up here, though. Because I know, I'm pretty sure he's not over there. So I'm going to actually stop doing that. Or wait a minute, maybe I'm not. Still five production. I can't get around that, can I? Okay, fine. Um, oh, yeah. Maybe we can do this. Yes, we can. Got it. A multitude of rulers and that a maybe king. means that we can... Oh, he's already got it. Never mind. One king. But he doesn't already have this. Maybe I can pull this weird trick off that I'm doing here. We'll see. Sitting Bull, Trade Mathematics, and all that kind of crap, and I can get this. I am the Lord thy God. Ragnar still didn't get that. Okay, good. Might be able to get currency. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Okay, we're all going up here, aren't we? Um, organized, not yet, not yet, not yet. Mm. 
Okay. Alright, I think we're almost there. Okay, we're ready to attack. Ready to attack. I'm just I'm just worried. Okay. We're alright. Currency. Yes. Did it. Thank you very much. Everything is worth what it Now we can get math. Hell yes. Uh or maybe not. Uh, well, now, now maybe we can maybe we can manipulate somebody into doing something, or get some happiness resources or something. It's like, okay, she almost has that. Do you have anything? I need what I need is stuff that's like. We don't want to start trading this technology away yet. Okay, fine. Uh, let me see what I have as far as, like, uh, access to resources. Boy, if I could do that clam trade, that would be awesome. Did it. Okay, good. Okay, well, maybe put that down, and then we might... Let's see, once that other Keshik is out, might flip uh, flip civics a little bit here. Okay, so this is takeable in one turn. All right, next turn. Um, not right now, please. With that. Whip that. Okay, so we got still some more stuff to whip. I want to take two cities at once. So we're going to need this guy right here. Okay, so we're gonna need at least four guys over there. I'm gonna I'm gonna keep take five just because you know bad luck happens, especially happens to me. So yeah, we're gonna destroy Ragnar in one turn. Hopefully, please don't have yes you. Dirty bastard. De Gaulle, I know you want to give me math because you're a prick. Yes. Give me that math. Give me that math. I might even go construction. We might turn this into an elephant rush, seeing as we're... We've got so many idiots that have elephants. So, yeah, that, that might be a thing. I don't know. Because we've got elephants now. And we're going for construction. Just hopefully he doesn't get it. Magically just doesn't get another guy in there all of a sudden. Uh, what else Let's see here? I'm going to get a Keshik, Keshik, Keshik. And what else can I do? Not really too much else to do. Okay. Next turn. Let's bring us back memories. Huh. <laughs> I would say, I would say next turn. Let's see if we still have that money. Oh, yeah. I've got a little money for trade. Hey, why not? I'll keep me alive. Okay, so I'm going to, yeah. Get ready there. Do we, do we actually need to wait? He's got, it's not a lot of defense here. See, he's got... Uh, that's going to take at least six guys. Yeah, I think we're going to need to wait. Okay, we'll wait. That's... that's You know, I potentially could have that, but it's it's in the gray area, I think. So, we're going to wait one turn. Let's make sure this place is still what I'm, what I'm expecting. Seems to be. Yes, okay, good. So far, so good there. So next turn we get it, which will be 425 BC, which is a little bit late, but you know, this is not a really great, the start is, is not, yeah, start was a little rough for this. Let's just put it that way. Keshik. Keshik, I'm going to switch to, I'm going to do a switch here. 
There we go. All right. Uh, next turn. Yes. Okay, please don't get horse archery. Or please don't get horseback riding. Uh, I'm going to say no for now, bro. Yes, okay. Good boy. Good boy. And now, let's see here. Can I get anybody on Ragnar? No. Okay, can I... Okay, no, that's okay. That's all I can do. So, um, let's see who likes Ragnar and who doesn't. Hyanna loves him. Peter loves him. But neither of these guys will attack right now. De Gaulle is a danger because De Gaulle likes him. Uh, and De Gaulle's right next to me. He might, might attack me. Oh, he doesn't like me. I can switch into his religion and he probably will like me. Oh, maybe not. Hmm. Okay, well, I'm just going to chance it because that's pretty much the only guy to attack, so... Or wait, maybe I could give him some tech, but no, he has all the tech, okay. Yeah, I'm just going to have to chance it and hope that uh, Ragnar doesn't get to bribe him on me. We'll see what happens. Okay, he's got... Uh, all right, this is fine. Okay, yeah, okay. Kind of expected to lose one there. This next one... Ah, oh, nice. Starting off on the good foot there. Same thing here. Helps when you're not fighting somebody who's protective. What about this? What are my chances? Pretty good chance there without even upgrading. Uh, we've got... Whoops. That's my timer. We've got a couple of workers there. All right, let me go over here real quick. Okay, good. That hasn't changed. Okay. All right, that's fine. Whoops. Really? Should be should be pretty high chance to get him now though. Nice. Okay, now we get our archer in there because our archer can help defend a lot better. We are taking him pretty quick. All this mess here with the jungle, this isn't as big a deal as you might think. Oh, he's still got a spearman over there, does he? Okay, glad I... Oh, you know, I should be doing this. Enemy military. Yeah. We should definitely be doing that. Um, construction, how long would it take? Ten turns? Do I have anybody that's going to trade it to me? Uh, do I need, really need to have it? Because I might, um, we could also go for feudalism in 22, 22, I think that's unlikely. I think we need to get ready for what's probably going to turn into an elephant rush because everybody has freaking elephants. Annoying as hell when you've got like a good, uh, a good horse archer rush going or so-so horse archer rush going and then you realize, oh wait, everybody has elephants. Kind of sucks. But anyway, uh, this guy can't really do anything. Best he can do is maybe win against that guy, but that's, I don't know. Okay, so we're, we're in business. I guess we'll start going for construction. I'll just say whatever, auto, auto that. Oh, wow, he's got a forge there, really. Awesome. Greenery and a forge. Let's build a bear, a gear and a barracks. And let's get those, uh, let's get that pasture online. Well, I'm going to go ahead and take a break right now.